एवरी वन दिस इज शिवानी हेयर वेलकम टू माई चैनल शिवानी क्रिएशंस टूडे आई एम शोइंग यू सुपर क्यूट एंड सुपर फास्ट मदर्स डे गिफ्ट सो हेयर आई हैव क्रिएटेड दिस क्यूट फोटो फ्रेम यूजिंग पॉपसिकल स्टिक दैट इज ऑल्सो नोन एज आइसक्रीम स्टिक एंड यू कैन जस्ट लाइट द फोटोग्राफ फ्रॉम टॉप वेरी ईजीली it's super easy to operate and i will also show you how to create this super cute glass jar which is filled with handmade paper quilling flower isn't it looking very pretty and i have also added the cute butterfly in the corner so let's get started so first i'm starting with making the frame and here i'm taking two ice cream sticks i have already added glue on the edge of one stick and i am just joining two sticks together like this you can use hot glue gun for the quick making but uh, according to me liquid glue works best it is very durable and it will never separate your parts sometimes hot glue gun doesn't work very good after drying so i would suggest to use glue Now in both the corners I have added little glue and I am going to stick one one ice cream stick on top of this. So first I am connecting with the top double sticks and then I will join with the bottoms. Liquid glue takes little time but it is best way to attach ice cream sticks together. Now I am just sticking in the bottom. like this align it properly from both the sides and allow it to dry now on top of this again i am adding little glue in four corners and horizontally i am adding one one stick on top and in the bottom it's dried now here again i am adding two more sticks on left and right sides vertically here i am making the slider for our frame between these two sticks we can easily slide our photograph so just attaching this and allow it to dry till the time i am just sticking these three sticks with each other to create the base like this and now it's time to connect our frame with the base so just add little glue in the bottom part of the frame and stick it exactly in the center to give it more durability and uh, stability we have to attach one one stick from front and back it will give nice support to our frame so just adding little glue and sticking two sticks one in front and one in back
and our photo frame is ready. Tada! Very easy. Now I am making small daisy flowers. For this, I am taking one fourth strip of white color, two mm, and making one pointed teardrop shape. Like this. In the same way, I am adding total seven petals together. For the center of the flower, I am taking one fourth strip of yellow color, two mm, and making one tight coil. And I will add this tight coil in the center of the flower. So this is done. Now to create the sepal of the flower, I am taking. Half strip of sap green color, three mm, and making one cone shape. Like this, just tapping the cone from bottom little bit, make it short. Pass one wire. Pollen through this, fill the cone completely with the glue, and then stick this on the back side of the flower. Like this, and I like to dry completely so your flower is ready. In the same way, I have already prepared four more flowers. So in total, we need five flowers for today's project. Now here I am taking this cute. Glass jar, which is actually a message bottle, having one cork on top of this. So I have just removed the cork, and I am using this as a jar. I have just wrapped one thin jute rope around this, added one cute bow in the front, and now I am just filling the jar little bit using liquid glue. Spread the glue on the edge using brush, and also. On the side walls of the jar, little bit. And then I'm just sprinkling some gold flower pearls inside this. Spread it completely. Just rotate the jar so that the part which is having glue. Will get the pollens on this. Just tap the excess pollens inside the bottle again, and allow it to dry completely. Since this is a clear glue, so it will dry completely clear. Now to create some leaves, I am taking small strips of sap green color, three mm. Just making one triangle in one corner, curling it using scissors. In the same way, I have already prepared some leaves. Just adding little glue inside the bottle and sticking these leaves one by one around the edge of the bottle.
like this so this is done i have just tied my all five flowers using white colored thread like a bunch just adding little glue on the leaf and then sticking my bunch of flowers on top of this and the cute flower jar is ready now taking back my frame and on back side i'm just adding one piece of pink color cardstock which is embossed using polka dot embossing folder i have just embossed it just for decoration you can simply attach a plain cardstock as well so it will cover the back side of the frame this step is not compulsory you can leave your frame as it is but i thought to cover the frame from back side and on the top i am adding this beautiful die cut out just to decorate the top then in one corner i am adding the cute green color butterfly and here i am adding love mom so for the love i have used heart design and for mom i have these die cut outs words m o m if you don't have die cut outs you can just write love you mom on any paper and stick it on the bottom side and then on the left corner i am attaching my floral jar i like to dry completely and the cute photo frame is ready this is very quick and very easy to make for last minute idea for mother's day and you can use this as any occasion like a father's day or friendship day or birthday because this is super easy to make and you can simply slide your photograph from top like this and whenever you want to take it out just slide the photo again super easy to operate so that's it for today hope you enjoyed my video please subscribe my channel for more interesting videos and please click on bell icon for the latest updates thanks for watching see you next time bye bye